there's not many 1.4 cars that can do that. What's good, fam? What's good? We're out here, Mr. Tiano. Tiano Fara. Today we want to find out why this car is so popular. Um, this is one of the favorites, if not the favorite car in South Africa. <coughs> and if you are a car enthusiast, you will know that this car is camp. Absolutely gorgeous. And the nice thing about the VWs, they don't give you unnecessary information, but the sound is... What's good, Ellie gang? Welcome back to another episode. So in today's episode, we want to find out why the MK1 is so popular in South Africa. Um, behind me, I have a 2006 City Rocks. This car is uh, owned by Dougie. It's uh, Mr. LeBreton. And uh, today we want to find out why this car is so popular. Um, this is one of the favorites, if not the favorite car in South Africa. Who doesn't love a Golfie Mark 1? Uh, everyone loves it. Um, those cars are very very re reliable very affordable and uh, also packs a punch this car is not your normal 1.4 uh, this car is fitted with a cam 272 cam and uh, also fitted with the noise boys exhaust and uh, also with your intake we'll take a look at that and have a listen to that a bit a bit later on um, it's also fitted with a 15 size spoons and it's running on a loading kit and uh, all in all very very nice car compact um, this car is very very low maintenance if you call it that way because the parts are available on every doorstep um, i also spoke to to the owner right now he said one of the the nice things about the car is is the parts that's uh, available everywhere and uh, i'm very very excited to hear how this thing sounds and uh, the the purpose of today's video is not really a performance uh, video however this is just to find out why this mark one is so so popular in south africa and i would love you guys to comment down below if you're watching from south africa if you're watching for anywhere else in the world um, uh, i would love to hear why you think this car is so special because uh, for me I, I this car is really have a very very special place in my heart and i uh, also saw on a post um, jamie Orr is a uh, american he came to south africa to build a vr6 swap mark one he also made a statement saying that if you thought germany is the capital of VW. You have to come to South Africa and really see what's happening here. Our police cars are GTIs nowadays. I don't know where they get the, but you know. Um, and also, this is the land of VW. Golfies in South Africa are everywhere. Uh, they also use Golfs or Mark 1s to, to, to race. And uh, trust me, you don't really want to take chances with the MK1. You never know what is inside. So uh, yeah, this is very, very, very golden cars in the country. So stay tuned for the video, we will have a closer look and uh, see what makes this car so special. Uh, if you have any comments, comment down below and I would love to hear where you guys are watching from. And uh, yeah, make sure you stay tuned for this video, it's going to be epic. And uh, on to the next one, let's go, boom! Alright guys, so taking a look at the MK1, um, uh, <clears throat> the first thing that you notice, the cars are really not that big, uh, very compact cars, but like I said, it can pack a, a very, very, very hard punch. Um, it's lightweight and it has enough power. So the car is fitted with a pair of spoons and uh, sitting nice with the 15 inches and uh, yeah, overall, very, very nice car. 
looking at the backside I have to say my goal is to get the MK1 and uh, yeah guys fitted with a noise boys exhaust system and uh, we'll hear how this thing sounds in a bit but overall very very nice car it's not too low though this is not built for stance it's just like a daily driver right and uh, yeah we'll just pop the bonnet and uh, see what is happening down below bra you ready to sell this thing huh? <laughs> and uh, yeah it's fitted with a straight intake from there till here um, would you want to give us a, a, a sound test of that? Are we? <laughs> it's going to have a sound test, guys. <laughs> I mean, if you don't like that, something is wrong with you. It's the OG sound. Um, Sounds incredible with the, with, the, with, the, with the intake, I have to say. And uh, coming to the inside, the velo steering wheel, always it's a winner. And uh, yeah, overall, car is in a decent shape. Uh, not your top, top showroom condition. Obviously, this car is used to, to, to drive as a daily. And uh, yeah, very, very nice. Just want to have a listen to the, to the exhaust at the back. So like I mentioned in the video, this car has a 272 cam and you can you can hear that. I'm not, I'm not sure if the mic can pick that up, but, but you can definitely hear that. So yeah man, comment down below uh, what you guys think of the car and I think it's pretty amazing. So let's see, um, let's do a sound test on the car and let's see what we, what we can achieve from there. Bro. Ah. So yeah guys, we are in the MK1 now, um, this thing sounds very very nice. <laughs> very nice bro. Oh, wait. Wait, we can just cruise up here. So yeah guys, so there's not many 1.4 cars that can do that. Uh, this is not a stock 1.4 however like I said the car is very compact the car has enough power and the car is not like ridiculously fast because that's not the purpose of the build if you want the car faster you can just do a lot of upgrades and mods but for now for what it is this car packs a, a very very decent uh, punch and uh, there's more than enough power bro. guys just want you to have a listen to this to this idle and if you are a car enthusiast, you will know that this car is camped. So yeah, I'll take a drive with the car now and just give my opinion. Alright guys, so I haven't driven a Mark 1 in a very very long time. Um, uh, very very special. Um, I love the dashboard, I love the gauges, I just want to show you guys quickly. Point of view. Very, very nice. I don't know, there's just something about the steering wheel and the dash that is so, so satisfying. Um, I really can't put my finger on it, but uh, it's very, very satisfying. Everything just smoothly falls in place from that side till here. It's absolutely absolutely gorgeous and the nice thing about the VWs they don't give you unnecessary information buttons and, and gauges everything is just so smooth and spot-on this is absolutely amazing this is why the people love this car in South Africa and uh, that is that is just 100% accurate that is the truth and uh, if you disagree comment down below but I don't think there's any any other legend that can compare to an MK1 in South Africa. Alright guys, so I'm just going to do quite a quick pull with the car. Thank you. 
Very, very nice, guys. And this intake makes a big difference to the sound. You can hear when you put your foot down, it's, it's there. Did you do the cam yourself? Yes, yes they were. And uh, what, what was the difference that you could feel with before the cam and afterwards? Yo, it's a big difference when I, in the start, when I launch the car, it can launch harder. Can do a quick launch with the car like i said this car is aren't really uh built for racing purposes like from the factory however with the upgraded cam the car can be launched a bit harder and uh there's some guys that can take a liquor hiding from this mark once don't don't misjudge yourself on that but uh we'll do a quick launch with the car like i said it's not built for that but with the upgraded cam you are allowed to launch a car a bit harder than, than normal so yeah let's check it out super nice super super nice guys this is the best of everything like I'm not here on the channel to drive people's cars but if there is people that allows me this is why I love what I do this is love, why I love what I do the car sounds absolutely amazing and uh, yeah all in all very very nice very very nice what's good fam what's good it's me out here Mr. Ziano Ziano Farah just want to say a big shout out to you thank you for letting us get here at the back of the Kumbi um, we're taking awesome shots from here. If you guys still enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up, comment down below where you guys are watching from. Also, thank you to Mr. Clint for helping me. And uh, guys, uh, that's a wrap for today's video. We're on our way back. Mr. Clinty, what do you say, bro? Nice. Lekker, man. Pretty nice, Lekker, right? Okay, yeah. Sounds great. Drives Lekker. Yes. Looks nice. So, yeah, it's noise. All in all, it's noise. So, yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, we're on our way back. What's up, guys? So, um, as you guys can see, um, views on views once again. I'm gonna say this now, I'm gonna say it always. I live in the most beautiful town in the world. That is serious for you. Boom, and then you're Stay tuned for more, guys. Let's go. Ciao. Consider it's pivotal, trap through the app, make her clap it, though cap it, she tapping it fast. I think that she know they be catching it. Standing six feet up, casting a shadow, but niggas that talk like they bad, they know that we doubt it, they talk.